In this presentation, we will assign costs to units using the weighted average method. In our problem, this was the given data we've seen in prior presentations along with this data, this being the unit data that we have, this being the cost data that was given. We then calculated in a prior presentation the compute equivalent units of production. So these are the equivalent units of production with regards to materials and conversion. We broke them out to the units completed and transferred out of the department and the work in process because those are the two things that we're concerned with because those are the two things we want to use in order to allocate out our dollar amounts to the dollar amounts that are still in work in process at the end of the time period in our department, the amount that has been transferred out. We then calculated the cost per equivalent unit to help with that, with that transfer process. And we have that broken out by materials and conversion, these being the dollar amounts. The total dollar amounts given over here, we know the 